Today's video is going to be covering the roofing of our dream house in Ghana. And this is going to start from the carpentry work to the roofing sheet. Hey guys, this is your guy Ali again from the Ghana Dream channel. Um, I hope everybody is doing great out there. Uh, if you're new on this channel, please don't forget to subscribe, share with friends and family. And if you've been here, you didn't do so, please, please remember to do so. Today's video is going to be covering the roofing of our dream house in Ghana. And this is going to start from the carpentry work to the roofing sheet. I would like to mention some few things before we get into the video. So basically, with this um, roofing we did in Ghana, um, it's kind of a six-step roofing style we did. You know what I'm saying? Because when I look around me, all the houses around and everything, it's kind of the same style roofing, which is like the A-shape roofing they normally do in Ghana. So we, uh, we decided to go with something different. So it's a kind of a C-step, you know, different shape style roofing. You know, we did something different, you know. Also, another important thing, if you find yourself trying to do your roofing in Ghana, please, please don't be cheap. Try and make sure you're going to treat the woods before the installation or before the camping through work. Uh, I'm saying this uh, because, you know, um, that's out of experience and uh, also the carpenter advised me uh, we have to treat the wood. It's going to cost you a little bit more to do, but I mean, it's always to be on the safe side, you know what I'm saying? So um, so we bought this chemical called dustbin. You know, we use a chemical called dustbin. The carpenter have to treat in all the woods and um, <clears throat> before he put it on top of the house. Uh, dustbin is a D-U-S-B-A-N, dustbin. You know, that's the name of the chemical. And also, we've got to be breaking down the the cost and um so at the end of the video we're going to try to put a cost breakdown of you know all the work we did uh but for now let me see what we have right here so now with the roofing at the carpentry side uh the labor cost us four thousand ghana cities uh the woods and the nails is uh nine thousand five hundred ghana cities and um with the roofing sheet, we went in a company called um, Raincoats, which they charge us 26,926.82 Ghana cities, including every lettering, you know, providing the uh, roofing sheet, you know, the workmanship, and um, 50 years warranty. You know, that sounds good, right? Yeah, 50 years warranty. You know, um, I trusted this company because since they finished the work, never have any leakages, everything was good. And, uh, you know, uh, I can recommend this company uh, for anybody, you know, who wanted to do their roof in Ghana. I mean, we were able to get an inside connection. I mean, how it is in Ghana always. He was able to show him the difference between the uh, the roofing sheets and uh, what's going to be best for where we live because we by the ocean and um, he chose the best one for us. So um, I think we save for now. Well, before we get into the video, uh, another thing I would like to mention, the color of the roof. Uh, my wife chose that color. That wasn't the color I wanted to go with. We went back and forth, back and forth with the you know, color we went back. At the end of the day, you know, I love the color she chose and it's a very pretty color. So um, let me see. What else do I want to mention? So as I was saying, at the end of this video, we're going to be uh, posting the uh, cost breakdown of every letting expenses we did and um, in uh, Dallas and uh, I mean Ghana cities. So guys, again, if you didn't subscribe on this channel, please remember to do so to, uh, to support the channel. And uh, if you're new on this channel, please remember to um, subscribe on the channel to support as well. And uh, before we go again, I would like to mention Ramadan Mubarak to all my Muslim viewers and subscribers and hi to all my viewers as well. So stay tuned guys and enjoy the video. Thank okay, you guys. Here we go. Well, basically what you're looking at um, 
they started by creating a main frame which is like the center frame of the uh, other side of the house which will be holding the other two by twos which will be sliding on the left and right side of the roofing yeah um and slowly as they go you can see the shape starts coming up uh also another important thing i would like to mention is um you know which i mentioned in one of the previous video you can you see that uh we already have the shape of the roofing bird with the bricks with the uh, blocks you see in ghana so uh that's the old-fashioned way of doing it but probably they, they said that's the best way and also we with the where we're building the pressure of the wind and everything it gives more strength and uh protection for the uh, roofing side of the roofing as i already said it's a c-step roofing which you're gonna see before the uh the end of the video right here same thing they begin to take the shape and uh you see they lay the main frames and on this side because of the size of the living room is huge so they have to put two by two together as you can see holding it they put it together to make it uh, i'll say four by four which give it more strength because it's gonna be a lot of load on that side um of uh, of the house and uh, it's big yeah so look at these guys this is crazy man they work with no um no safety nothing and uh i believe they know what they're doing they've been doing this for a while yeah uh, so you can see they're trying to put it together and that's the way they get it on top um uh, in the middle of the in the middle by, by the uh living room so that's how they do it they push it slowly while the other guys are helping on the other side <laughs> and now they set it up you know they leave space in between and that's the wood they was trying to put it up and um they're gonna put it in the middle trying to set it up before they started taking the shape um on, on that side of the house yeah so what he's doing now you can see um another wood a piece of wood to hold it down so they can work safe yeah you can see right right here what he's doing yeah so that's what i was just explaining he's trying to uh, make sure he, it's cured so uh well you see the shape of the uh roofing and this is what we're talking about <laughs> as the shape keep going they press it they put it they put all the two by twos on it and the shape is coming out slowly And uh, this is how it's gonna look the back side, the middle side, the kitchen, the office side, the family area. And uh, that's how it looks from the outside, from the back of the house, when you look at it from the distance. Um, yep. So now, moving forward, you see the fisher board start coming in slowly. You know we're making a progress yeah so that's how um the shape is coming in slowly and you know we're moving forward inch by inch you know they said thousand miles of journey started with a single steps so you always gotta start somewhere um yeah moving on guys now uh raincoat is here and um this is uh, how it all started. They bring the, um, the roofing sheet and I think they started work the next day. So as you can see, the sheet is going up. The roofing, I mean, the roofing sheet is going up. They put it in one at a time, you know. They put one sheet beginning and they're gonna lock it and put the other one on it. And I think they overlap each other while it keep going and um, yeah these guys using some kind of a clamp you know he clamp it together you know yeah that's exactly what he's doing so at the end of the day it's like a one big one one complete whole roof you know because they all clamp together and um and uh it come up like this so this is what we have at the end of the work this is what we have 
and right here is uh, the stairs this guy is creating the stairs that is going to go on top of the rooftop so guys after hard work and everything this is what we have and that's how the shape of the you know roof looks like and the color and everything as i said again we never have any problem of leakage and when it rains in ghana whoever been in ghana knows it rains hard you know it rain it come down like crazy so this is the shape we have living room dining room office bedrooms you know you know um, all different shape uh, of the roof and it's very low roofing when you look at uh, background you can see the other roof over there is high roof you know um going high i didn't want to do something like that right here that's how it looks from inside you know this is from inside of the house and um that's which can, uh, that's what you can see before we do the pop or the ceiling work so and um right, right here this is from the outside so guys as uh, as you can see we have the roofing done we're moving forward step by step and this is uh before uh plaster guys again if you did not subscribe on this channel yet please try to subscribe share with friends and family and leave a comment 